Ah, here we go. It's not getting echo. Okay. Oh, it's the Blood King Helm. Uh, apparently, a lot of people are getting that for free, but I think you have to uh, have default main slots. And that's what I'd have to do. I'd have to wipe my data to get that. From what I understand, it's, it's in the comment section under one of my videos if you want to find out about it. And this is nice because it gives me time to kind of practice this thing. I need to get better with these double-handed weapons because these are definitely helpful when you got crazy people with shields and whatnot. So thanks, dude. Thanks, dude, for the uh, practice real quick. Practice doing this. I'm just not doing that hard enough. You got to kind of like learn how to do things harder. It's just like swinging a hammer, you know, like in real life. Some people just can't swing a hammer. They don't know how. They don't realize that the hammer has to do most of the work. You're just launching it. It's kind of the same thing with a lot of these weapons. And I'm very awkward with stabbing. I need to practice stabbing. I got the overhand and the handle jab thing down. Like, I could destroy this guy real quick overhand. But I'm taking this opportunity to work a little bit slowly. Take my time with these jabs. Apparently, it's a lot more effective overhand anyway. Like, look how much quicker I'm killing, especially with that handle. That handle ends people, dude, because the kinetic energy of that entire weapon's going right to the butt of that handle. So, like, if I come in here, just start, bam, look how much damage that handle did. Okay, let me just fold it over my head. Come in. Boom. Okay, that was a both hands. Oh, that was the blade. Let me practice that again, the handle. Bam! Look at that. Oh, shit, I fucked up. I need to learn better control of those because if I master a double-handed weapon, I might just stick with double-handed weapons, like honestly, because you really need that reach in this game. And you can get out of a clinch. If, if somebody backs you into a corner, you can actually wedge that thing up between their arms where they can't get you and carry them backwards. I'll see if I can't demonstrate that. Maybe with this guy, but he has a ball flail. That's kind of dangerous. So I need to try to make quick work of that freaking ball flail hand if I can get it. These things are nasty, dude. I just got to work on my uh, health management. And I left my head naked. I'll just go ahead and do that. Now, he might wise up here in a second, but keep that hand up there. Keep that hand up there. Keep your fucking... No, 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 no. Hold your ball flail up there so I can hit it. Hold your good hand up there so I go... Well, you're gone anyway. I just clipped you with that. That butt end of the weapon is, is what got him. Just that little clip. Uh-oh. Smegromorphs are difficult because they have reach. Oh, oh, oh. When you get that handle in there, dude, that handle fucks shit up. The freaking star flail definitely has gone down a notch. I've noticed that when I used it. Like, I used it in rank today, and it was like a tomato on a string, basically. It didn't really do much at all to the, the gold armor. Yeah, gold armor tends to, like, resist a lot of blunt force trauma. Especially with a flail, it seems. This might, this guy might <coughs> be better, but... <coughs> I already broke his arm with the butt end of this thing. And chopped his hand off. So he has inferior arm. No mail under there. Dude, you need to put mail under your shit. It's all your belly. Your belly's naked. You ain't got no mail. He's kept, oh, 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 oh. Just stab you in the dick because there's nothing protecting it. That's why you wear mail to protect your dick, dude. Because I'm just going to chop, chop up your dick real quick.
See, see, that was all the handle right there. While I was bashing him with the freaking blade, that handle hooked his freaking good arm down there. That screwed him up. I'm wearing fucking gold armor, what am I afraid of? It's like, hell no! Fuck that! I'm so used to being naked, I'm like, intimidated by all these people. And this guy, he, he, he doesn't have gauntlets, so he's, he's not gonna have a good time. Unless he gets really... Oh, he, he got good. He got me. He ghosted me. These guys you want to scrunch in on because you don't want to give them that ball flip... Give that ball flail room. Unless he's one of them little tight hurricane twirler guys. Those guys you gotta watch out for. I'm one of those hurricane twirler guys. And he got an arm, and he got the other one. He might be one of those guys. He's getting a lot of good consecutive hits in. I'm gonna have to keep my distance with this guy. I can't scrunch this guy. Because when you scrunch, and the tighter you spin that ball flail, the faster you can hit with it, because it has a, a smaller radius. So when you scrunch in with a ball flail and spin it really freaking tight, you get a like a quick chain of hits and they can fuck you up real quick, like catch you off guard. It, it depends on the player. Some players you want to keep your distance. Some players you want to scrunch in there and tie them up. Uh, this is one of them guys you want to keep your distance because he's getting like them tight little hurricane, the little spiral swings. Those fuck you up. Oh shit. This spear is badass, dude. It's better than the hooked one. Cause that hook tends to like grab stuff, but this this just glides right off so you can repeat strikes. Oh shit, I'm hemmed up. This is bad. Oh no, no, no. Oh you lost both. Catching that ball flail, dude. Yes. Watch out for that gladius, dude. He'll get them gla that gladius underneath my arms and fuck me up. If I'm not careful. Uh oh. All right, Bobo. Bobo's gonna fuck me up with that goddamn refrigerator door there. Oh, come on, Bobo. Come on, Bobo. Shit, 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 shit. Get out of there. Yes. Alright, I got the dangerous part. I'm happy. I chopped off your dangerous bit. Oh, wow, where did that come from? Holy shit. Oh, yeah, my face is naked. <coughs> That's all he has to do is go for my face with that sickle, and it's over. And my face is right there. 
and he's boxing me in. Yep. That sick, <laughs> that sickle was perfect shape to enlarge in your nasal cavity. So you can breathe through your neck hole. I like that. Sure, sure, Bobo. Now I'm perma decapitated, asshole. Okay, moving on. shit no more. I fought him before. I, I fight him off him. Off him. What the fuck? Okay. Oh, here we go. He's like, no. Hell no. He's got he's got a fucking baseball bat. He thought he was gonna beat on some smegs. That wasn't the case. No. <laughs> Fuck that. Oh, man. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, that thing's fucking terrible. That thing will break both of my arms in like three seconds. Boom. Yeah. Almost three seconds. That wasn't even a hyperbole. Hyperbole. You want to focus on hands. You want to step back and try to get hands. Like like I just did. Oh, he's still got one and it's dangerous. Shit. You don't want to waste swings either. That leaves you open. some shit to cut out anyway. Okay, sickle. Bobo! Shit. Fuck you, Bobo! No! You cannot have my brain juice. No, you can't. Oh, shit. You can reach my brain. Oh, shit. You can reach my brain again. Keep backing up. Oh, shit. Some people I just can't double hand. I think Bobo's one of them. He got me. In the dick? I guess karma's a bitch. Okay. Well, I'm perma dead. I look like a lubber grasshopper. Um. Alright, I guess that's the video. I died. My naked head. <laughs>